la flor de nuestra juventud, nuestros mejores jóvenes a la batalla. Creo que también sé cómo lloran sus madres y cómo se lamentan sus familias. Oyentes, yo también haré una nota personal sobre esta situación. Esta guerra para mí no tiene ningún sentido. Ustedes que tienen sobrinos, hermanos, hijos, luchando en esta guerra innecesaria, por favor, abrázalos. Diles que los amas, lamentablemente, la verdad es que puede ser la última vez que lo hagas. My love, as I write this letter, a heavy rain pours outside, much like those crazy rains of El Yunque. And by the time you read it, I will be on the other side of the world. I'm going to the war. I'm going to Vietnam. My promise of getting you that life you always wanted will still come true. My decision to go and fight may come as a shock, but I know serving my country will get us there quicker. Being a soldier, in the greatest military in the world demands respect. With that respect comes opportunity. They say that you can still get a good education and be somebody. I know a lot of people don't share my opinion. But we're US citizens. Why not fight? All I can think about are your beautiful eyes and your smile. I know I will behold them once again. They will be my guiding light back to your arms. Ay mamá, qué calor. La temperatura actual es 93 grados. Estamos en Nueva York, en Puerto Rico. Ahora a las noticias. Después de semanas de negociaciones entre bastidores, la administración Carter llegó ayer a un acuerdo con el Congreso y se organizó en un proyecto de ley que fijaría el salario mínimo federal en 2 dólares 65 centavos la hora. El acuerdo significaría aumentos salariales para 4.5 millones de estadounidenses. I don't know what that was. ¿Qué te pasa? Are you nervous about today? No. I'll be okay. I feel good. Sin tu cadera no puedo cantar. Sin tu cadera no puedo gozar. Oye, Rubensito, ¿qué estás cocinando? So good. A ti no hay nada. Are at breakfast. You remember Toñito from down the street? The short guy. Talks really fast. El hijo de Señora Clara. Ah, yes. She's a nice lady. Mm. Isn't that the guy that's always trying to sell you something? Yeah, but that's not the point. Anyway, 
He says this place is hiring like crazy. I got a good feeling about this one. Uh, how about that bicycle you wanted? Oh yeah, I like bicycles. What else you want? Mm, a Barbie. You want a Barbie? Mm -hmm. I'll get that for you. How many you want? Like 17. Oh, I don't know if I can do that, but Daddy will try. Bye, baby. Daddy will be back ahorita. Love you. Love you. Bye, love you too. Wish me luck. Good luck. Hey, babe, como te fue? Dad, 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 did you get the top? No, didn't get it. Domino, huh? You know, your abuelo used to always say, this game of dominoes is como la vida. One wrong move, and all of those close to you collapse. Today, daddy's dominoes fell, and they've been falling. One by one, every time I get up, I build up a domino, and it falls right back down. You know, the other day I went to watch the news, and they talk about something called domino effect. I never heard that before, domino effect. I thought it was something, you know, you get when you play too much dominoes, but it wasn't it. They say, how you do one thing affects the other. And it makes kind of like a, like a chain and keeps going. I made a decision many years ago that I thought would change my life for the better. But it's not going how I want it. And in the TV they said something about Something as simple as a smile can start a domino effect. And then I look at you and you got your beautiful smile. And how loving you are. And I look and I say, you're going to make a difference. Maybe you change this world for the better. You smile at somebody, you change somebody's life and it goes and it goes and it goes. Y sigue por ahí. You might start your own domino effect. Me, I haven't been that lucky, but I'm gonna keep trying to get my dominoes in order for you. All right, baby, now we can play. It's gonna be dark, but we can do it. What's going on? Arya, Arya, mommy, just go to your room and lie down on your bed. Okay. Hey, Luisito, let's get out of here, man. The city's going crazy. Let's go shopping, papa. Listen to me. There's nothing happening out there that you need to be a part of. This is not what you do. Tú no eres un pillo. You are an army veteran. Un hombre de respeto. You know, back there, I had a buddy. My best friend, El Minio. One day, we're traveling south on the High Bank Pass when he lost a piece of his rifle. 
He reported it to the sergeant. And then waited for weeks to fix. Y nada. What are you going to do in Vietnam without a weapon? So he stuck with me everywhere we went. One day, he decided to ask the sergeant about the rifle. What did he get in return? Soldier, I like your courage. For that, you joined the tunnel rats. They could use someone like you. Find all the bombs you can, son, and take your friend with you. And on it went like that for a while. Every day, looking for bombs. Until the day he died. Because of him, I live. That sergeant threw us in those tunnels not to help us win the war, but to die. For no reason, but to die. So you want to talk about respect? Right now, estoy sin trabajo. People spit at me, look at me like I'm the enemy. Ungrateful. All the blood I left back there, y pa qué? Beg because I'm so respected, right? Listen to that. Nothing that is happening out there is for you. All the things I've seen and done. And I come back and I can't even keep a job to support my family. I went to war. I killed people. I know that fear. And you know what scares me more than that? That little girl. Where'd you get those? Every time you run into them, it takes you back there. So I hid them. And now, I just want you to take a look at them and realize what Edmino did for you. He was there for you, right? You want to be our support? Then be here, now. Who's it out there? It's okay. He survived. Sally, come to play dominoes. Coming.